This woman called her own daughter fat on Facebook. I think my mom's called me worse. Not on Facebook, though, curiously enough. When you step outside for two seconds and the sun tries to melt your face off, should melt your mouth shut, so no more intake. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. I'm fat and ugly. Thank you so much. I just wanted to know why. What's your email? Uh, what for? Also, which one? Your email address. Yeah, but which one? Also, why? Personal, like the one mom has access to? Okay, also, why? Just give it to me. Dad, just tell me why. It's not that big of a deal. Let me guess what his response was. If it's not that big of a deal, then just give it to me. Dad's trying to sign up for a free trial using your email. More than likely. So that just means you're gonna get a bunch of spam crap. I mean, we've all gotta screw Amazon somehow, right? Just keep getting them free trials. Why not? Go for it. I don't. I just mooch off of a friend who has been paying for it for years, but that's different. <clears throat> All right, let me see. I'm on the phone. One more time, give it to me before I get upset. Why is it so hard for you to just tell me why you need my email? Thanks for nothing. Okay, whatever. It's a simple question. Answer your phone. Why aren't you answering your phone? I'm back from taking out the dogs. Mom told me what's up. It would have been easier for you to just tell me why. Of course it would have been. Now I'm actually curious. If you found out why, please let us know the reason. I want to know. I hate stuff like this. There's no conclusion. There's not going to be any closure here, okay? Ugh. I'm going to be thinking about this all day. Also, can we stop saying would of? Seriously, stop saying would of. Nobody says that. It's would have or would have. Come on. What my girlfriend's mom posted right after her and I moved out. Oh boy, here we go. This is blank. We need to continue proclaiming the power of God over his child. He is lost, and we know God will leave the 99 to find his lost child. What? Please continue to cover him in prayer until he can't see anything but the never-ending love of God. Satan may think he's won him over, but Satan has no foothold here. He is a child of God. Calm the hell down? <laughs> From a hand to paddle to hard labor. For a typical child, no delays or mental issues, at what age did you stop spanking? My boy has always been in the 99th percentile for height. I couldn't spank him with my hand after five years old. A paddle lasted for another year for safety offenses. We switched to 100%, or sorry, 100% to hard labor by seven. What does that mean, though? Because that could mean a lot of things. When they, when, they, when they put hard in quotations, are they moving bricks across the backyard for fun? Like, what are, what are you talking about? Are you making them clean? Narc mom trying to make my great-grandmother's funeral about her. Thanks. Any news about great whoever? I haven't heard anything. I did get a message from mom saying that she will be very distraught if you attend and ignore her. She asked to just show compassion, and if not, I respectfully ask her not to attend. What the hell? Do you see what's wrong with that? It's not about her. If I go, it's for great grandma and to be there for everyone else. Hell yeah, I'm ignore her. It's not about her. It's not about her. And tell her you won't pass any messages on to me. She's trying to use this to get into contact with me and make it about her, and it's extremely disrespectful, not only to me, but more importantly, to our great-grandmother. Yeah, it's pretty sad. I told my mom, who demands proof that I'm eating every single day and flips her sh** if she doesn't get it, that I walked five minutes down the road to go get food at Whataburger. This is how she responded. I'm really at a breaking point with her. All right, let's see. Why didn't you order? You could have been hit by a car. No, I was perfectly fine walking. I can look out for myself. I'm an adult. They aren't on Uber Eats or DoorDash. Random crying cat emoji. I know how to navigate. I'm about to be 19. Oh my God. There's tons of busy traffic up there. I know how to watch for cars. It was a shorter walk than to my classes. <laughs> I like how they're asking, how many lives did you have to go through? That's not the point. Quit being so protective. They're gonna be okay. Hashtag throwback. My mom, folks, it took her a long while, but she actually has stopped this nonsense. <laughs> oh God. Let's see what we got. <clears throat> Mother. I'm not trying to be an ass, but I'm beyond sick of this. You are causing me undue stress with all of this apocalypse crap. I barely read any of this thread. You sincerely need to take a break from the internet, Just take a week off, get back into crafting stuff. This is unhealthy. I'm serious when I say if I get one more of these messages, I'm gonna block you. I can't handle more of this end of the world stuff. I will quit with you. Keep an open brain. I'm here. Found out a lot in the last few hours. All is well. Still going to be crazy, but all is well. Just sit back when it starts and let it happen. <laughs> yeah, um, I fully, 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 fully agree with this. I cut most of my family out for various reasons. One of them, not the highest on the list, I can assure you, is that I'm just tired of being around people that are constantly, constantly threatening everybody else in the world with the end of the world. 
I'm tired of seeing headlines about how all of us are gonna die in three hours. I'm tired of being told by other members of my generation that I'm not gonna get to live until I'm old. I won't hit old age, blah, 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 blah. Not true, by the way. It's not true. It's just what people like to say. It's all about doomsaying. We got the doomsayers walking around in the streets, ringing bells and screaming. And sometimes they're in your own home and it's obnoxious. I consider constantly scaring children and other people about the end of the world a very hit form of abuse. It is. Stop it. I thought I'd never be someone who posted here. I really like my mom and we've always gotten along. Age of majority is 19 here. If you do not turn your life 360 location back on by five, I'll be turning your phone off. I told you before I pay for it, uh, you have to have the app, okay? You don't want it, then pay for your own phone. None of this needs to be the way you're making it. You won't... God, it's so hard to read this. Maybe it's the colors. You want to be treated like an adult, but you don't want to do what I ask you to do. Majority of the time, while living in the home I pay for, and you live in for free. So you can pay rent or find your own place. I love you. You do realize you're under a legal obligation to house me until I'm 19. I'm finding my own place to be nice to you because it's what you want. I'll text you from my new number when the sim arrives. Suck it, mom. <laughs> Always call that bluff if you have the means. Do it. See what happens. I'm sure they'll get a little, uh, pissy. It's so fun. Apparently she controls the parenting plan. What? I'm supposed to have you. Are you home alone? No. And no. I am supposed to have you. you. Just said that. I'm guessing something dad have you? Yes. Well, you talk against the law. Your dad keeping you from me is against the law. Okay? So if you don't want the cops to show up again, I would suggest he goes by the, the parenting plan. Okay? My dad and I were having a friendly chat about my Friday night plans, playing a board game called Muffin Time. All of a sudden, he hits me with this gem. Big target. We're playing a card game called Muffin Time. Serena Williams would be good at that. She has massive muffins. Pretty gross thing to say, to be honest. <laughs> Just out of left field. Excuse me, Dad? What are you talking about? A moment of sweet karma for my best friend's nutjob transphobic mom, posted with permission. Okay, good. Just want to tell you that I would never say I told you so. You just did. I know you think I've been too crazy slash obsessed with trans slash detrans content. Oh, oh, you're obsessed with detransitioning content, huh? Good. But the result of spending so much time with the issue is that I really get how complicated it is, how strong the pressures are, and how challenging it is to wrestle with all of this. I do know how hard it is. After multiple texts of detrans posts, she forces him to read and discuss with her. Okay. Rain, I locked myself out. <laughs> that sucks. I don't care. I mean... I'm getting married at a pagan bookstore. Told my father, and this was his response. He hasn't talked to me since. He isn't Christian, just his side of the family. <laughs> it's even better when it's not their actual faith themselves. You can't get married there. Why not? It's where Blank and I want to get married. You're going to have to leave all of my family out of it. You should have plenty room for friend's girlfriend. Tell all of my family you eloped. They can be tolerant for one day, and if they can't, they don't have to come. Uncle and grandmother already said they were coming. I've been tolerant every single time I've walked into a church for them. They can offer me the same grace on my wedding day. It's disrespectful to shock and horrify your Christian family. <laughs> They'll be fine. You know that. It's like you try to be the biggest embarrassment to me that you possibly can. I'm not coming. You're not coming to my wedding because I also invited your family? Really? It sounds like you said this was your dad, right? Yeah, yeah. That guy. <laughs> these always make me curse. I'm trying to be a little more lighthearted this time around. I really am. But these people, they make it so difficult. Imagine saying that to someone. It's like you try to be the biggest embarrassment to me that you possibly can. Okay, if I'm that embarrassing, you don't have to talk to me anymore. Do not come to my wedding. You will not be allowed in. Just recently got my phone back so I can post this. My mother cut me off from my best friend after we moved because I was talking about the abuse with them. How are you? You all right? Yeah, sorry. It's okay. By the way, did you hear about Netflix doing a... Oh, My Hero remake? Anyway, Blank, this is Blank's mom. I have asked him not to be in contact with you because you're delusional and disrespectful respectful and convinced him to do unsafe things. Please do not contact him again. I don't know where these people come off. I don't know where they get the idea that this is okay. Found in a group I'm in. Can't imagine what her son is going through right now. Friends, I need input. I'm going through the worst trial of my life. My beautiful daughter started testosterone to transition to male. The devastation isn't able to be conveyed verbally. Oh no, is something literally not happening to you? Is something not happening to you? Oh my God, I wish I could help you. I feel led to fast while I pray for him to come back to the truth. 
My ability to rationalize and reason is just gone. Help me. How would you proceed with a fast? As many details as possible. Please be kind. Edit. He's 20. <clears throat> Are you asking people how to fast? Here, I got one for you. Stop f***ing eating. Are you a mo- I, uh, Oh, these people are crazy. These people are crazy. Dog got put down Saturday. Mom was being a jerk about it. Why aren't you responding at all? Don't get used to me being gone, kiddo. It's not like I don't exist, kiddo. I don't know why I read kiddo twice. It's only in there once. I think- I think I'm insane. On the day Archer was getting put down, you said Archer was my dog, really. You don't have any respect at all. I don't want to talk to you because of something extremely rude you said. I don't care if you think he was your dog. He was a family dog for us. Are you serious? Do you think I would type an entire paragraph for something funny? I mean, anyway, not the point. Wow, I didn't realize you thought of me as having no respect at all. Raymond, you will not talk to me that way. Um, Raymond just did, and it sounds like you deserved it. Just because you're older, or the parent, doesn't mean that respect can't be taken away from you because you're an asshole. My dad's, who was just diagnosed with progressive dementia slash aphasia, birthday present this weekend. My mom's mad at me and canceled our plans. I'm really sad. I just want dad to be happy for his birthday and be surrounded by people who love him. I absolutely cannot believe how you treat me. Yes, blank has officially rubbed off on you. Misery definitely loves company. This is why I don't feel comfortable telling you how I feel. I just tried and this happens. Because you don't treat me respectfully as your mother? Dude, if you're a bitch to your children, respect can be taken away and it should be taken away. Old does not equal omnipotent. That's not the right word, not omnipotent. There's a word, there's a word, I just don't know it. I feel like I'm giving the same amount of respect as you're giving me. Oh, okay then, duly noted. I thought children were supposed to respect their parents, no, not if they're assholes. If you lose that respect, you're gonna have to earn it back. Saw this in free alerts from Facebook Marketplace. Free girl and toddler girl toys clothes shoes. My girls didn't want to clean their room, so I grabbed and went with the trash bags, okay? Teen girls, clothes size 10 through 12, and women small 0 to 5. Women's shoes, Nikes, Kevin Durant, blah 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 blah, toddler clothes, yada 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 yada. Uh, let's see. They're gonna have to learn their loss, your gain. Just taking all of their clothes away? I don't understand. What's your plan here? Because you're gonna have to buy them more clothes. I hope you know that, right? So, who, who are you teaching a lesson here? Mom stalked the school grading site when I was in school to see what my grades were and tracked my attendance. She had moved out of my state by this time. Wait, what? Why'd you miss school again? My car stopped working. Okay, but you have like five absences and four latest, or lates, excuse me. I have two absences for this semester. I'll check the grading site later. And if I need, uh, I need to. Wow, these are really hard to read for me today. And if I need to, I'll stay after to make them up. I can't help my car being breaking down, broken down, breakity broke broke. The caffeine's, it's, it'll get there. It'll get there, I promise. I'm leaving all this in on purpose. I know you can't, but I also don't want you not to graduate because you missed too many days. Can I please call you after work? I'll explain- No, you don't owe them an explanation! You don't! So many people feel like explanations are required. Hey, uh, you had an absence. Why? None of your f***ing business. <laughs> I don't care if you're my mom, I don't care. Mother didn't drop brother, 12, off for my dad's custody time. Had cops search and apparently she ran three hours away to my grandmother's. Extended family wouldn't respond to me asking if my brother was simply okay. Mom is abusive. I left home last year. But her side of the family cut me off and took her side. Uh, do you know if they're okay? Haven't heard from him, and I'm worried. Please just let me know he's alive and fine. Can you or some other family member just give me a sign? D dude, spam these people. Annoy them. This is ridiculous. I had this conversation with my mom after she got angry at me. Told me to get a new mother. Called me selfish and told me I was emotionally abusing her because I didn't have time to reset her Facebook password for the 20th time. Call me ASAP. I'm done taking your abuse. Our relationship is over until you're ready to be an adult and apologize for your actions. All you have done this past week is disrespect me over and over. Take some accountability and stop blaming people for your problems. Goodbye. F you. Lose my number. Very mature for a 40-year-old woman. Good job, mother. Have a nice life. F you, brat. Doesn't sound like your mother to me.